Hey there kids and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic the Hedgehog 2. We are at the fifth zone, uh, hilltop zone. As you can see, we are on the tops of hills and there's a nice little cloud effect in the background which I like. Uh, so, yes, this zone, uh, music, uh, it's pretty good. Um, it has a funny, it sounds like a baby crying or something in the very beginning. Um, so that's, that's kind of funny. Um, overall, the level, uh, it, it's pretty easy, um, for being this far into the game, you know, the fifth zone. It's about halfway, but it's still pretty easy. Boss, um, he's pretty easy too. Um, but that's less later. So, uh, I have mentioned this before yet, but, uh, I know that this probably isn't getting very many views. I mean, maybe like... 40 views at the most in like a week, probably, um, as my as part one has about 40 something views. But uh, those of you who are watching, you know, I appreciate it. Uh, you know, I'm doing this for fun. I like doing this. Um, so you know, it'd be nice if more people did watch. Uh, but hey, I can't complain. This is fun. So all right, that's that's enough of that. So those things, little seesaw, tear tar things, those are pretty fun. Um, and Supersonic, again, uh, I haven't mentioned this yet either, I like Supersonic's theme a lot, um, it's pretty much a remix of the Invincibility theme, and the first part of it, the intro, Octobus interrupts us, he's online, no one cares, go away, okay, um, if you realize, if you noticed, when we started the special stages, it was the same startup theme. Uh, and here, I don't know, that's just a glitch. I don't know what, hap what happens there. I'm like in the lava, I was very confused. But it's okay now. Um, so, yeah. Um, there was a couple hidden hidden paths here up on top and the bottom. I, I try to get up on top. Um, it's kind of hard sometimes. It's kind of hard to control Supersonic because he's so fast you can't really control him on little small platforming sections. But uh, yeah, the lava and the floor will raise up and Tails is possessed again and he dies, which he deserves because he's a fucking idiot. Um, yeah, so these little sections like that where the floor will rise up, the lava will rise up, you know, that's pretty easy for Supersonic. Um, so Act 1 is done. And if you are playing on the uh, Xbox arcade version, I would suggest if you do finish a zone um, and you have 50 rings and you're supersonic still, don't jump again because it can sometimes freeze and you'll be stuck there, which has happened to me many times. Um, uh, maybe I'll show that in like a bonus video with glitches or something, I don't know. That's yet to be seen. But here we are in Act 2. Uh, so those, yeah, you just basically make sure you're, you're in a ball when you're going across those, so you can break through. Um, more of the teeter tar things, those little balls or something, I don't know, just red balls that, you know, weights, I guess. The Sonic's dancing again. Uh, I, I always do that. I never went up a lift or something past the time. And those dinosaurs are pretty cool. Um, little lava dinosaurs. Tail sucks. He falls again. And the f goddamn Orbanaut, the fire Orbanaut, whatever. A bitch, I took him down though. It's all right. Uh, yeah, so you get uh, you go pretty high up and a lot of speed in this uh, this zone. Um, so you get, again, here's another example of the floor raising up, but this is like painfully slow. So I'm just jumping around to pass the time here. But uh, yeah, it's a very easy section here. You just gotta wait, be patient until it lifts you up. And yeah, those little things on the roof there, they will drop their spikes on you. Easy to, to avoid. More dancing. Always gotta dance, make Sonic dance. And here we go. More of those. And yeah, those ring boxes up there, you pretty much have to be going pretty fast to get up there. Either as supersonic or having more momentum than I did, but those are um, easily gettable if you are supersonic. 
So, I get hit by the spike because I'm a dumbass. But that's probably for the best. Because I don't want to be super sonic when fighting the boss. Because I think it's kind of cheap. Um, and yes, I did do it in Casino Night. The spikes get me again. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try to avoid being super sonic when fighting the bosses. Um, yeah, these lifts. Um, you know, it's kind of a interesting thing, I guess. It's pretty cool. Instead of just dropping straight down or a ramp or something, give you little lifts. And Tails always falls off them and dies. That's pretty funny, too. Nice added bonus there. Um, so we are finally at Robotnik. And his machine here is easy, except I don't know why I go through him instead of hitting him. But usually, you should just get, like, jump on him once or twice and get multiple hits in one jump. But for some reason, I kind of sucked at it. And of course, I fall in the lava again after his final hit. So I'm just, I'm just, I just suck like that. So here we are at the end. Capsule time. Spin dash time. More f animals coming out. So I will see you next time in the Mystic Cave Zone, where the game starts to get harder. So until then, see you later.